Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and the visionary of the Valder Beebe show, God Talk. Some people talk to God and others believe that God talks to them. Join us in conversation with authors, religious clergy, metaphysicians, and regular people like you and I and God Talk. God Talk is a podcast available on FM Radio, Roku TV, and online. Subscribe at ValderBBShow.com. You can also subscribe at YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. Join the conversation of God Talk. I'll see you there. Good day, and thanks for staying with me while I got, got my next guest. My next guest is Dr. Kenneth Adam. He is the Chief Medical Officer of Medic. Uh, excuse me, Chief Medical Officer at WellMed. Thank you so much, Dr. Adams, for joining us. Good morning. How are you this morning? I'm fine. You're with United Healthcare, and you're with the Medicare Retirement Area. What are the health concerns that can be managed to potentially keep us at home longer? And that's a question I know a lot of my listeners have. There are a number of chronic conditions that can be managed from home, like COPD, heart disease, diabetes, urinary incontinence. Those are things that can be evaluated and treated via telemedicine uh, from the comforts of your own home. So you don't have to drive to a physician's office, pay for parking, wait in their waiting room. Uh, you can deal with these things uh, from your iPhone or your iPad or your computer. So you're saying we'll do more telehealth visits and that way our... Uh us or our parents, they don't have to leave home to get care and recommendations? That's correct. There are a number of things that you can do with preventative health, uh, like scheduling colonoscopies, uh, doing breast cancer screening, having hemoglobin A1C. You can schedule all those things from the comforts of your own home. You can actually have a nurse come out and do your hemoglobin A1C. Uh, so there are a lot of things that uh, you can do to uh, ensure that your chronic conditions are managed uh, and that you stay at home as long as possible. That brings up a question I've had for a long time. What about those people who are not uh, young, older people who are not technology savvy? How do they get into the mix of this? You know, you'd be surprised. Uh, we have found that was one of the silver linings of COVID that even our older uh, members that uh, are 65 and older actually really didn't have a whole lot of difficulty managing uh, getting online with their providers. We were pleasantly surprised at how easy it was uh, to, to get our members uh, to, to talk with their physicians. Medicare is constantly collecting data. What did they what have they found that is crucial to keeping patients at home longer? Coordination of care is one of the most important things for members, and that's making sure that your PCP is talking to their specialists and that you're having your uh, routine uh, exams done appropriately uh, and that everyone is actually communicating with their, uh, each other. Another thing that's really important is are addressing the safety issues at home. If you have urinary incontinence and are rushing to the bathroom, the likelihood of falling increases. Uh, so it's important to address safety issues within your own home. Will the medical team bring this up? Because I'm thinking of diet, exercise, all of those are stumbling blocks to well care. Absolutely. And there are a number of things that you can do within the comforts of your own home, Tai Chi, chair aerobics, uh, visiting with a dietitian potentially or a nutritionist from your physician's office. Uh, those things can be done in the comforts of your own home. How does my audience get started for them or their senior that they're caring for then? One of the places you can find more information is wellmedhealthcare.com slash at home, A-T-H-O-M-E. Uh, and that's a good place to start learning about the things that you can do from, from your home. I, once again, I want to let you know that you've gotten great information from Dr. Kenneth Adams, the Chief Medical Officer of United Healthcare, Medicare, and Retirement Plan. Dr. Adams, that's great information. My audience is made up of baby boomers, and 89.9% .9 of those are women, and I'm sure this information will go a long way. Thank you so very much. Thank you. Have a great day. Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I host the Valder BB Show, broadcast on radio and television, and this is My Phone Pouch. My Phone Pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, 
pocket free, purse free, even belt free, head on over to myphonepouch.com.